Okay, assalamu alaikum. Now, Indian fashion and Asian fashion is all about color. Uh, some of the garments that you get are so, so colorful and so bright that it just makes you wonder uh, how somebody is uh, going to wear this. And now this uh, particular garment, I mean, it's absolutely, absolutely gorgeous work. If this was in gray, you know, uh, I'd love it to bits. But then they've put this absolutely shocking, shocking fluorescent pink with it. Uh, I was actually surprised uh, when my daughter bought this in. It's one of her friends, and uh, you know, um, she was she was commenting that uh, her friend was being very courageous to wear something like this because Halima is one of those people. I've been mentioning her quite a lot because she's very, very especially when it comes to times like Eid and. Uh, uh, weddings, I find it very difficult to find designs and uh, fabrics to suit her or to her liking. And she's quite surprised when her friends, you know, come out with garments like this and then I throw it back in her face that, look, your friends are wearing this. Why can't you even wear something like this? Anyway, the reason why I'm doing this uh, particular uh, video is that this garment has come in to have sleeves attached and uh, Sometimes you can have a real big problem finding matching to go for the sleeves. Now the sleeves have actually come with this and they're in this fine net but it's very see-through and really the point of having the sleeves is to cover the sleeve, uh, cover the yarn and then this is not going to do the job. So uh, anyway, half half lining is what they want. So I had a quite a big chase looking around trying to find uh, the colors too much and I couldn't find anything that went with it. Now if you put a different color then you've got a problem that um, it's just not going to look right and uh, sometimes you can combine two colors to make it look right. Uh, so what I've done here is I've combined like a real pink because this is like a peachy pink or a fluorescent pink and then I've got the shocking pink uh, chiffon and I've combined it with a peach and the two the peach and the pink combined together end up coming out as a same shade to this net so when you put this now with the actual dress there isn't any difference and that's basically what you want you don't want it looking so different that from the sleeve upwards then you've got a totally different shade so here I've combined the peach and the pink to give it that right shade. So sometimes you can put two colors, a lighter chiffon base color, like say even if you've got like a dupatta lying around, but the dupatta is too thin and it's not the perfect shade. You can put some other shade underneath it and see, you know, mix a blend them. You know how like how they blend uh, colors together to form like a lilac and another color. I don't know. You know, like the rainbow colors, you bl blend two in to form one color. So if you experiment, you can get, I mean, this shade, I could have chased around all of, you know, my town and still not found the right shade. And sometimes time is more precious. So experiment and go around your own house and look at the odd pieces and stuff and see if you can combine two pieces to actually match the shade. And sometimes that does the trick. Even if you're in a shop and you're finding it really difficult to find the absolutely right color, then have a look at two contrasting colors to combine them together to make it the one color so hopefully that's a tip for you to be working on and uh, we're gonna go on and attach these sleeves anyway the style of this dress uh, in the past I've shown you this uh, wavy curly effect uh, lace thing on this dress they've got uh, a metallic thread that they've used in and then they've used the wire to curl this with uh, and that can be done on an all um, no some of the overlockers they have the uh, edging as well and it can be done but it is a little bit tricky anyway the style of this dress is actually it's got a scarf that's been has it got a scarf? yeah it's got this scarf which has been sewn into one of the pleats and it sort of wraps around and then it's got this nice lace thing going around and uh, apart from the colour the design is wonderful the beaded embroidery is absolutely beautiful it's just a shame that they could have used 
a slightly a lighter color and uh, you know what this would have been an absolutely stunning outfit <laughs> 